How about eating foods mixed together with other foods? What bracha do you make? Very commonly, go to the store and you buy yogurt. In Israel, yogurt is often called leben. And they mix in with this leben, with this white stuff, uh, fruit, a um, little bit of fruit. You mix it up before you eat it, and it turns red or blue or yellow. That's a mixed fruit, yogurt and fruit. Two different brachot. One bracha on the yogurt, shakol varo, another bracha on the perot, borei pri ha'etz. So, well, I mean, it depends, doesn't it? Let's say I have a yogurt, and it has a little bit of fruit in it. Enough fruit to change the color, change the taste a little bit, but I don't really see fruit. So then the bracha is on the ikar, on the main thing that I'm eating. And the main thing that I'm eating is the yogurt. And then on the tafel, the fruit, which has a different bracha, boy priya eats. We don't make that bracha. We make only the bracha shakol niyabed ver. So we've introduced ourselves to a primary issue in Hilchot Brachot. When you eat two things at the same time, which bracha do you make? The rule, of course, is the rule, of course, is that you make the bracha on the ikar first and on the tafel second. But it's not always easy to know which is the ikar and which is the tafel. Let's go back to our example. You came home with a big uh, a basket full of strawberries. You cut the strawberries up, and there they are in a plate, and you decide that it would be appropriate to eat the strawberries mixed with a little bit of yogurt. Well then, you have big pieces of strawberries, and you have a small amount of yogurt. So of course, in such a case, you would say, the ikar has become the strawberries. And the tafel, the secondary uh, food that you're eating, has become the yogurt. In the first case, you've got a lot of yogurt and a little bit of color from the fruit and a little bit of taste from the fruit. You make the bracha shakol niya bitvara. In the second case, when you have a lot of fruit, big pieces of fruit that are visible to the eye, and just a little bit of yogurt to keep it sort of all together. In such a case, you make a bracha boy pra eights, and you don't make the bracha shakol bidvara.